know you will. But all the same, remember everything I said. Stay alert. So when you get to the cities, make your observations and move on. I understand. But you're being paranoid. I'm inspecting security, not charging off into battle. There's not a lot that can go wrong. Son, Emperor's safety is concerned. Anything could go wrong. Off with you now, and good travel. Farewell, Father. I'll return as soon as I'm able. Well, this is it then. Look after yourself, Gaius. You're doing your duty, and I'm proud of you, but you better come back to me. You hear? No, I don't. I may travel alone, but you know I carry you always in my heart. I'll see you soon. Did they do all of this shit just to make us feel bad or something? Just walk behind him. Trust me, we have nothing to say to one another. Cool. Cool. With that said and done, I'ma kill your boy. Yes, it is. Save. Wait here. Again, just to be sure, just to make sure, make sure. Ah, whatever, I'll just see y'all when I'm killing the guy. And he is dead. Nothing expected to happen, I just killed him in solitude, that's it. I almost got caught though. Ah, at last. I've been anxiously awaiting your return. Gaius Morrow is dead. Yes, I know. You have done well, and have earned both your reward and a bonus, as I have mentioned. But you should know that we have a more pressing matter to deal with. It's... Cicero. There's been an incident. You should proceed into the sanctuary. I'll let Astrid explain. Cool. Just try to relax, Rosario. Let the elixir do its work. You'll feel better shortly. What? Ah, thank you, dear. You are most kind. The jester's cut feels as bad as it looks, I'm afraid. Damn it, this never should have happened. We knew better. We knew better, and still we let our guards down. Ugh! I'll admit, even I'm having a hard time disagreeing with you. Marrow is dead, I know, but we've got bigger problems right now. Gabriella mentioned something about Cicero. The fool went absolutely berserk. He wounded Vizara, tried to kill me, and then he fled. I knew that lunatic couldn't be trusted. Oh, it's true, I'm afraid. Cicero was a little whirlwind, slashing this way and that. <laughs> it would have been funny if he weren't trying to murder us all. <laughs> Don't forget the ranting and raving. About the Night Mother, how she was the true leader of the Dark Brotherhood, and Astrid was just a pretender. Look, we've got to deal with this situation. You've got to deal with this situation. What do you want me to do? I want you to find that miserable little fool and end his life. But first, find my husband. Make sure he's all right. After the attack, Onbjorn flew into a rage. When Cicero left, Onbjorn went after him. 
They disappeared into the wild. Search Cicero's room. Maybe there's something in there that sheds some light on where he might have gone. Let me know the minute you find something. I've got to see to Vizara and calm everyone down. I am fool. Who's the fool now, hmm? Hush, Vizara. You were very brave. Astrid may well be dead if not for you. She's right. I'll be forever in your debt, dearest brother. Now be quiet. Just... just rest. A little murder happy family. I like them. Like what's all clone happened. At least you know that Athen clones way. Is there a part six? found something? Yes, Cicero's journal. Good, good. Does it say where he may be headed? Yes, an abandoned sanctuary in Dawnstar. I have the passphrase. The Dawnstar Sanctuary? Whatever for. Never mind, it doesn't matter. You need to leave. Now. Every moment counts. So I want you to take my horse. His name is Shadowmere. You'll find him outside by the pool. Let's just say he's one of us. Find Arnbjorn, make sure my husband's all right, and then send that jester's twisted little soul to the void in as many pieces as possible. I took that prancing fool into my home, and this is how he repays me? Is the Night Mother still there? I would assume that she is. At least I believe she, she is. I remember that she is. So, uh, yeah. You have anything to say? Huh? What am I fucking reporting? Go kill Cesaro. Anticlimactic in a way, but you know, it's, it's whatever. You are now my horse. Are you faster than normal? Maybe. Most probably. I was going to use the horse in the first place, so it really didn't fucking matter if I got one. But I like this horse. It's black with red eyes. It looks nice. I like that it comes out of a pool of leftover cum. It being leftover implies the fact that it's being it. Some blood. Yeah, got 
gotta admit that little Chester's good with that butter knife. But don't worry, I gave as good as I got. Where's Cicero now? In there, through the door. Some old sanctuary by the looks of it. I would have followed him, but I don't know the phrase. I know the phrase. I'll get Cicero. You go home. All right, you convinced me. Doubt I'd be much good to you anyway. The little fop cut me pretty deep. But I slashed him good. Pretty sure I severed an artery. Don't know what you're gonna find in there. But you can probably just follow the blood. What is life's greatest illusion? The size of a lace packet. You would think that the size would correlate to the amount of chips inside, but no. What's inside of it is air. I understand that it has to have some air to preserve the product and have it not mash up, but have you ever gotten a bag of lace that's not destroyed on the inside? Much less the air preserves the crispiness of the lace, right? But I'm sure as shit that they could have more lace on the inside of the packet and it still be crispy. Screw the protection of the lace itself. The air inside of it doesn't protect jack shit. But you buy a freaking bag of lace and you get like what? Two pinches. It makes no sense. Anyways, innocence. Innocence, my brother. Blurred. Listener! Is that you? Oh, I knew you'd come! Send the best to defeat the best! Oh, as you knew the stupid wolf couldn't slay, slay Cicero! Pirate King? Luffy? too much now ah, the fuck What that? No, not that. That. I got that already. I think. A grimoire. I haven't even went on in yet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> that that was actually kind of funny. Fuck you. Guardian just called out father. Hmm. I was about to freaking hit it. Like it would actually break. You trifled with my, um, family? I just met them like a while ago, so I don't really follow up. But anyway, you trifled with my family. I kill you. No, I slay you. been like a, I've been gone for what like an hour or something dog since I paused the recording I disappeared because I got a phone call from a close through my computer whatever that's besides the point Um, I really don't want to do that. Or whatever. Okay, now. Hmm. Already have that enchantment. Give me that. Give me that. Ooh, I have one little sorry, don't I? Yeah, I do. That 
that's not worth the lock that it has on it. Oh, yeah, I'm following the lock. Oh, the fuck did he hit? There might be something to block it on the other side. This is where I'm going, right? There is only one cure for your madness, Cicero. Me. Oh, <laughs> I like that. Very good, very good. <laughs> Creative. <laughs> but killing me would be a mistake. Oh, yes. You would displease our mother. Hmm? <laughs> for she's your mother, too, isn't she? This, no. No. Walk away. For Cicero live! Tell the Protector Aspirin that you did the job. Stabbed, strangled, drowned poor Cicero. It would be lying. Oh, no. Okay. That was that was, that was just do what you will. Cicero has no fight left. with it. I was just expecting <coughs> more, I guess. Oh well. I went, I made food, all that kind of a shit, so. Yeah, I'm gonna go and eat. It's been a minute, again, like an hour. It, I watch videos, all kind of a bullshit. But yeah, here I am again. Arnbjorn is safe, and for that you have my thanks. But what of the fool? Is Cicero dead? Yes, Cicero is dead. Excellent. Once again, you've proven yourself a born assassin. Tell you what, why don't you hold on to Shadowmere a while longer? He's a fine steed, and hasn't been ridden nearly as much as he should lately. And now that this Cicero mess has been mopped up, we can get back to the matter at hand, hmm? Right. So what's my next task? There's just one more target before we strike out at the Emperor. Have you by chance heard of the Gourmet? Read his cookbook? It's become quite a phenomenon. 
The gourmet is scheduled to cook for the Emperor at a special dinner. You'll kill him, steal his writ of passage, and assume the role of Master Chef. Festus has been spearheading this part of the assassination plan. He's close to uncovering the identity of the gourmet. You should report to him. Cool, cool. <laughs> Kill well and often. Eh, I try. I heard about what happened. You're referring to that blacksmith contract. To kill triplets secretly, and then have the whole thing blamed on the mother. Remarkable. When one can divine the future, success may not be assured. But it can at least be anticipated. Oh yes, I was also going to check my fucking future. Have my future read. It helps that I've already foretold my own death. Cool. It's been quite a boon, looking like a child. No one ever suspects a thing. There you are. Took your sweet time dealing with Thank Cicero, you. eh? Now let's get down to business. Astrid told you about the gourmet, I hope. ...that I need to kill him and take on his identity. Quite so. But first, you'll need to learn who he is. Assuming, of course, that the gourmet actually is a he. Could be a woman, for all we know. <coughs> so you don't even know who the gourmet is? Wonderful. Don't be so petulant. In my uh, investigations, I came upon this. It's a copy of the Gourmet's cookbook. <laughs> but not just any copy. It's signed, you see. Seems to be a message from the Gourmet to one Anton Varan. I've tracked Varan to the keep at Markarth. It would seem he's the cook. And this Anton Varane knows the Gourmet's true identity. I believe so. Therefore, you are to obtain that information from Varane. Who the Gourmet really is and where he can be found. Oh, and when you're done with Varane, kill him. Loose ends and all that. Next, you'll have to... Are you still paying attention? Oh, I'm waiting with bated breath. Huh. As I was saying, you'll need to kill the gourmet, of course. But what's more, you need to get his writ of passage so you can take his place. Oh, and if you can, hide his body. The longer it takes for anyone else to determine his real identity, the better. Now off with you. Remember, the Markarth Keep. That's where you'll find Anton Varan. Probably. 